Hey everybody, it's Professor Williams, and today we're going to look at decision making under uncertain conditions. We're going to look at two approaches, the maxi-max and the maxi-min. When we talk about decision making under uncertainty, this situation occurs when it's unknown which state of nature is going to occur in the future. And I've also been unable to assign a probability to any particular state of nature occurring. In essence, the decision maker has no information about what's going to happen in the future, and so they're going to develop a strategy based on payoffs. In two of the approaches to making decisions under these uncertain circumstances are the maxi-max and maxi-min approach. Which approach a decision maker takes is often determined by their outlook and their goals. So I'm going back to my hot dog stand example. I identified that I have three alternatives. I can open a small, medium, or large hot dog stand here on the Outer Banks, and I know that I have three potential states of nature. Tourist traffic is either going to be lower, the same, or higher than it was last year. And I use these three alternatives and three states of nature to create myself a payoff table. So here's my payoff table. And so for each of my decision alternatives and each state of nature, I have a payoff. So for instance, if I open a small cart and tourist traffic is lower than last year, my payoff will be $150. So under a maxi-max approach, what we're going to do is we're going to isolate the maximum payoff under each decision alternative. And then I'm going to select the decision alternative that produces the highest of the maximum payoffs. This is a very optimistic approach to decision making. So I've looked at my decision alternatives and I say this is the highest payoff for the small cart. This is the highest payoff for the medium cart, and this is the highest payoff for the large cart. So here is what I'm faced with. So my maximum payoffs are 175, 125, and 160. Based on a maxi-max approach, my decision will be to open a small hot dog cart since it has the highest payoff of all my decision alternatives. So I'm looking um, at, at this from a very optimistic standpoint. The other side of the coin is this idea of maxi-min, a much less optimistic approach. Um, really, it's saying we're going to make the assumption is that the worst is going to occur, and so I want to minimize that damage. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to determine the smallest payoff under each decision alternative, and then I'm going to select the best of the worst case scenarios. So my worst case scenarios are for the small cart, I'm going to lose 25. The medium cart, my lowest payoff is 75. And for the large cart, my lowest payoff is a negative $80. So here are my minimums. The negative $25 for the small, the $75 for the medium, and the negative $80 for the large. And so I'm going to pick the best of the worst. So under a maxi-min criteria, my decision will be to open a medium hot dog cart since it is the best of the worst case scenarios. Hope this helped. I'll see you guys around.